At some point, most cats experience an episode of vomiting or diarrhea. But what does it mean? And what should you do about it? In this chapter, we'll talk about the general categories of gastrointestinal diseases and we'll give you some advice on what to do if your pet is experiencing GI upset. There are many different disease processes that can be associated with vomiting or diarrhea. In some cases, such as intestinal parasites, the initiating cause is centered directly within the gastrointestinal tract itself. In other cases, like kidney disease, a primary problem leads to secondary GI signs. There are quite a large number of both primary and secondary gastrointestinal conditions which can be associated with vomiting and diarrhea in cats. Some conditions which may be associated with diarrhea include colitis caused by diet changes or dietary indiscretion, antibiotic-induced diarrhea, intestinal parasites, inflammatory bowel disease, bacterial infections of the GI tract, viral infections of the GI tract, several types of cancer, kidney disease, liver disease, exocrine pancreatic insufficiency, and organophosphate toxicity. Some conditions which may be associated with vomiting include intestinal parasites, gastrointestinal foreign body, inflammatory bowel disease, hyperthyroidism, several types of cancer, hairballs, and overeating. With so many different medical conditions associated with vomiting or diarrhea, you may be wondering what to do if your cat has one of these symptoms. As a general rule, frequent or persistent vomiting and diarrhea will require your cat to be seen by your veterinarian. However, mild, short-term episodes of vomiting or diarrhea can sometimes be managed symptomatically at home. Before attempting home management, always start by calling your veterinary hospital for advice. Their knowledgeable staff will be able to advise you on whether or not your pet needs to be examined by a veterinarian. And if home management is appropriate, they can also make recommendations on how best to care for your cat. Keep in mind that cats are notoriously good at hiding the true extent of their illnesses. If you are in doubt as to how serious the problem is, it's always better to err on the side of caution and have your pet examined by your veterinarian. Remember, vomiting and diarrhea can quickly lead to dehydration, and unlike people, cats can't force themselves to drink plenty of fluids when they are not feeling well. <laughs> 